Okay, here we are, Long Beach. Uh, we're taking the VRC Audi out for a blast with the um, French GTOs. Continuing the theme of uh, looking at uh, some of the older mods. And of course, Long Beach is the perfect place to take out something with so much brake horsepower. <laughs> and so much, uh, well, rather so little uh, driver aids lots of bumps to catch us out if we breathe ever so heavily on that accelerator or get slightly over our bunches a lesson in patience and control I would say this is um, and holding on for dear life so at the moment we're uh, obviously we're in traffic so we can't really open her up, um, but once we do, this thing uh, just wants to go slip angle city, um, which is great on the normal track, but uh, here at Long Beach, with all the bumps of the road circuit, that can get tricky. Looked in my mirror for a second and nearly ran in the back of an F40. Whoa. Okay, yeah. Getting out on the slippy bit, locking the tyres up everywhere. Dip the clutch, go, go, go. Just keep your head in the game, Owen. Okay, that's one of five laps down. crashing into the back of me please much uh, much appreciated run it all the way out to the wall you will pull in he will pull in thank you wow AI going uh, blocking central as we get a back end shimmy going on there over the bumps It's a tight circuit at places, so whoops. But again, you've got to watch your braking over to some of the bumpy areas because you can lock up, and that's not good. So maybe we'll cut the inside, block that entry right off. So many blind spots on this car, it's unbelievable. I know there's somebody around me somewhere. Top gear and brakes. It's good on the brakes though. Cleared them. Flipping down to first. Okay, so now we've got a little bit of a gap. We can start to use the circuit as we understeer towards the tyres and don't get to use any of it. After your uh, markers and your apexes on this, get a big blip on the downshift. Just try and keep that uh, chassis compliant. Oh, brake late! Brake late! Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Little lock up at the end. Little sideways. Got away with it. Get it down to first. Tyre's got a little bit uh, heated over that little manoeuvre. Threading the needle around the little roundabout. Clutch. 
masses of turbo lag on this thing so you really do have to uh, use every trick in the book just to get them revs up and get it back on power whoa big slide and that snatch at the end the other f is closed right back up on me give me a friendly nudge thanks very much okay don't miss your braking marker Owen the car kind of skittering around. Oh, 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 oh. That's a first. I don't seem to be making a mark on this F40 at front. So let's talk a bit about, about these cars. So they are paid content. It's paid for mods, um, actually made by uh, a member of one of the big modding teams, and uh, yeah, it's a bit of a bit of a custom build, really. Um, a lot of work's gone into it, and it really shows it's uh, been fine-tuned with an inch of its depth. It's, life um, so you gain a lot of well a lot of kind of graphical stuff when you look at the car but the uh, physics on it the feedback on it especially in VR is beautiful and the sound uh, you can usually find it as a two-pack deal where you get this and the Chevrolet so this is the best of the two mods but that said, the Chevy's good as well. Gosh, getting jammed up there, man. Uh, 40 on the outside. So that's the race over. Thanks for watching. There's a bit of detail inside the car, as you can see. Absolutely beautiful. And it's even got a windscreen on the inside of the windscreen. A windscreen wiper, that is. Well, there you go. That's, that's where your money comes in two windscreen wipers one inside one outside right thanks for watching have a good weekend